own costly. Bad enough to throw it anywhere, but that drives coaches insane when they're thinking about, hey, we've got a shot at points already. We're already in a spot where you're thinking you've got three on the board for sure, and to come away with nothing, that's a really tough one for them to swallow. Yeah, will they make up for it? On second down, it's Coleman. Not much there, maybe a couple up to the 35. Ready for the second quarter, and it's our visitors with the football. An entertaining start to this one. More to come on EA Sports. Garoppolo looks to throw. And tight coverage there. It's knocked away incomplete. More problems here on third down. They've converted only once so far in this first half. And you know as well as I do in this league, if you don't win on third down, it makes it hard to win a ball game because then you're relying on your defense, relying on your special teams. You've got to get it done with your offensive unit. Nice job bringing that one back. 14 on the return. And it'll be Dolphin football. Out comes the Miami offensive unit now. They get set to take over. It hasn't gone particularly well for them. That's obvious. In these conditions, no points so far. They've got to get that offense on track. The question, how do they do it? It is the age-old question, isn't it? And to me, finding a way to make sure your playmakers touch the ball without it being too exotic. Meaning you don't have to go deep down the field. Maybe you hit them on the short passes on the perimeter. Make sure you just turn around and hand it to your best runner and get out of the way. Don't cause any extra stress on him. He's got a man complete. Devontae Parker. And all the way in for a Miami touchdown. Devontae Parker, 79 yards. And the Dolphins have taken the lead. Good throw there, and I don't want to blow it too out of proportion, but he looks a lot more comfortable in his second season. You can tell he put the work in in the offseason, and what I mean by that is understanding the playbook. Not just the plays and how to execute them, but how to do it against a variety of defenses. Also understands his team better, what they can and cannot do. You can see the confidence rising in him as he plays. Jason Sanders now for the extra point. And it's now a 7-2 ball game. Now after the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. This is fielded a couple yards deep. And all that work, but he stopped where he ultimately would have been, and he simply taken a knee, and that's the 25-yard line. Here we go. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway, and it's been a rocky start for them thus far. They had the turnover and then the punt on those first two drives. So there is optimism because they've improved, right? The turnover, you just noted it. Punt's better. Drive. Punt's better than the turnover. The punt is better on the second one. Now they're hoping to turn it into first downs and hopefully points. Hand off, Coleman, right side. He'll have a first down past the 40. And down right around the 37. A big chunk of yardage there, 37 yards. I think they like this drive a little bit better there, partner. Running game helping out, picking up some of the slack. Because remember, the last drive, they went three and out. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. Debo Samuel was the intended receiver, but it'll be second down. Line of scrimmage again to 37 as they line up second and 10. Now Garoppolo. And this one incomplete. Too much contact to hold on to that one, and it's third down. It's a lot of contact going on there, and in the end, unable to keep two hands on the football and bring it into his body. Everything looked pretty good until the finish. Play fake there to Coleman. Now Garoppolo. And now Garoppolo lost the football. On plays like this where the ball comes free, it's often unusual for the team that lost it to get it back because... This is, this is the quarterback. The ball gets away from him. Everyone else is trying to execute what they're supposed to do on offense. They're usually looking in the other direction, downfield, 